Hey, what's up everybody? Josh here. So today we're going to do the walking water experiment. So without further ado, let's get started. So the first thing you're going to need is some glasses. So in between each glass, you're going to have water and then no water. Second, you're going to need some food coloring dye. Uh, for example, green, blue, red, and yellow are the basic colors that I have here. And thirdly, you're going to need some very absorbent paper towels. So when it comes to the paper towels, the more absorbent, the better. And then you're also going to have to fold them a certain way. Here I fold it hot dog style twice, and then I fold it hamburger style. Now I do have seven glasses, so I will need six of these that I'm making now. All right, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to add this red drop to each side of the glasses. So one on the left side and then one on the right. A couple of drops, maybe five to 10, it all depends on how much water you have. And then I'm here, I'm adding blue. I don't have a yellow sticker there, but it doesn't matter so blue there and then I put yellow here all right got that done and out of the way and next thing you're gonna do is just add your paper towels here just like so and you're gonna continue like that all the way through All right, so it's been about two hours since we started and these are our final products. As you can see, the water level here has decreased and then the water level here in the middle uh, has increased. This has to do with the water walking over. And if you look right here, the red and the blue make purple, the blue and the yellow make green, and the yellow and red make orange. Now, I use seven cups. You don't have to use seven. You can use three. Maybe like a blue and a yellow make a green. But it's a really cool experiment, really fun to do, super cheap, and uh, yeah. Thank you so much for watching the video. If you did like it, give it a thumbs up. And also, if you like this kind of content on a weekly basis, smash that subscribe button. And also, let me know what you think about the video down below in the comments. And again, thanks for watching. Y'all have a good one.